welcome to the Geeks Matcher. So today we're going to be talking about why your skin lightening creams don't work. Okay, I know this is an issue for a lot of people. Like you get the skin lightening cream, you start using it for the first few weeks. It seems like it's doing something right. And then for the next few weeks, it just completely stops and your skin starts redarkening and you lose that glow and your, your knuckles start getting darker. Your ankles are a little dark. Your knees are super black. Your elbows are super black you start having hyperpigmentation and discoloration and this is the exact reason why okay so if you your body um regener regenerates <laughs> every 28 days that means every 28 days your body reproduces more melanin so as a black person as a brown person or if you have um descent in asia some parts of asia that um produce brown skin you your skin naturally produces melanin it is deeply rooted in your dna for your skin to produce melanin so if you are tackling your skin lightening only topically it will it, it will always be on and off sometimes you'll be really fair sometimes you go dark it'll be on and off because you're tackling it only from the outside that's why i always advise people to take glutathione to take um, skin lightening supplement pills that is one of the most effective way the most effective and the most permanent way to lighten your skin because you are not just lightening your skin you are altering your dna to produce to stop producing melanin um, or like to produce very little melanin to reduce the the melanin production that's exactly what you're doing but if you only focus on topical creams and only topical stuff you are not tackling your skin lining from the inside then your lotions will work and sometimes it'll stop to work that's the first reason so your skin is made to produce melanin every 28 days your skin will produce enough melanin to go around your entire body mass okay so if you only do topicals after the 28 day mark your skin will look like it's redarkening you're going to lose that glow you're going to lose that brightness that you've struggled to have for 28 days so that's what happened that's what's happening second reason why you think that your why your cream doesn't work is people we need to when we get a particular product we need to stick to that product i used to be very very bad at this i would use a product three weeks and i'll be like oh this product's not working i need another one and then i get another one and be like oh this one's not working i need another one and then my entire bathroom was filled with bottles of half emptied lotions toners serums scrubs and oh, everything you can imagine it was a lot so one day i cleaned out and i dumped everything because skin lightening products are very complicated when you open them you have to use them in a in a certain time frame and if you don't the chemicals in there are exposed and most often they don't even work anymore you're just wasting your time so i dumped everything and decided to focus on one brand so focus on one brand for at least four months for you to know if it works or not how do you focus on a single brand i by the the lotion if if they have a lotion i get the lotion if they have a body scrub i make sure i get their body scrub if they have um a toner i make sure i get the toner and i always use kojic acids kojic sand soap so that i don't have any exceptions to that so i will buy everything from this brand but i make sure i keep my kojic sand soap so yeah that's what i do so always skipping from one product to another you don't give your skin enough time to adapt to the product and do the necessary changes that it needs so if you if you start using a product what what is skin lightening product especially the first thing it does is it repairs your skin after repairing your skin then it starts lightening your skin but if you don't give the lotion that chance to completely repair your skin before it starts lightening then you will complain that it's not working but I guarantee you it works you just need a little time now I'm not saying that every lotion works there are some lotions that <laughs> 
no matter how hard you try it just doesn't work you know it just it does not work at all and that's okay you can just switch to another lotion and you know stick to it until you find out that it doesn't work before you move to another one skin lightening is patience if you're not patient you will st you will burn your skin you will use fake products you will use products that don't work for you and you will have discoloration and your neck will be a different color your face will be a different color your hands will be a different color you will have dark knuckles and all those you know funky stuff that comes with bad skin lightening all right so you need to give yourself some time for your body to adapt to a certain cream before you make any assumptions another thing is to exfoliate your creams will not work if you don't exfoliate you need to exfoliate at least three times a week if you're doing skin lightning if you want to exfoliate more sure why not but too much exfoliation dries out your skin and make your skin dry and your skin will become a little scaly and shiny you know not the good shiny but like the dry shiny you know and your skin will look literally you have chapped or cracked skin so that's not a good thing so you need to exfoliate your skin to take out all the dead skin cells that way when you apply your lotion your lotion applies smoothly and it has more effect and it will work more all right and also another thing is do not um do not stay it well it still goes alongside with the with the um, exfoliation do not stay too long in the shower because you're stripping your skin off of moisture and do not you know take a shower or a bath with extremely hot water your water needs to be lukewarm so it can open your pores up so when you apply lotion the lotion just goes set it doesn't just set on your skin it goes deep into your pores and you know does it's magic so another reason why your creams don't work is because you do not wear sunscreen if you're on a skin lightning journey it's of utmost importance that you wear sunscreen i don't care what's happening you have to wear sunscreen even if you're stepping out and it's raining you need to still wear sunscreen even if it's winter or it's super cold outside still wear sunscreen you need to wear sunscreen at all times as long as you are leaving your house make sure you have sunscreen on and for people who are doing glutathione another reason why your glutathione is taking longer or it does not work at all is because you are drinking alcohol i think i mentioned this in one of my other videos it's called things um not to do while taking glutathione so you need to stop that immediately and the final thing that makes your lotions don't work is that if you are transitioning from one lotion to another this is what i do you need to give your skin time to rest if you are if you are moving from one lotion or one brand to another you need to let your skin breathe how do you let your skin breathe you go buy a moisturizer you can buy a dove moisturizer a vaseline moisturizer or cocoa butter or palmas moisturizer buy a moisturizer not a body lotion or you can use baby oil or um you know avocado oil or you can use olive oil or coconut oil on your skin so give yourself at least two weeks or sometimes even more when you take a shower do not use harsh soaps use nice moisturizing soaps because you are you are like rebuilding your skin you are preparing your skin for the next lotion so you use subtle soaps you use a good moisturizer or you use one of these really nu nutritive oils on your body you can also use a sweet almond oil on your body use all of these things to you know to feed your body because your body is like a person your skin is like a person in its water in its moisture and in its air and in its from time to time in its sunlight so you need to feed your body so when you do this always make sure there's an interval between changing your lotions make sure that um you know you have like a one week or two week space or sometimes even more where you just let your skin breathe where you just you know 
exfoliate with your normal sea salt you apply your coconut oil or whatever oil you have or your moisturizer and you use your regular dove bar soap or nivea bar soap or any ole shower gel whatever works for you you use it so always make sure that from time to time you let your skin relax okay and if you if you've attained your dream complexion what you do now is maintenance so if if you're applying lotion twice a day you start applying your skin lightening lotion only at night and during the day you use a regular moisturizing lotion and if you exfoliate three times a week you can exfoliate two times a week or one time a week that's how you do it so thank you guys so much I hope that you learned a thing or two from this video and before you were quick to dismiss a product remember you need to give it a chance and you need to be patient except the only exception is when excuse me the only exception will be when you start getting stretch marks or you start getting um, negative skin reactions or you start getting a rash or you it burns your skin then I will tell you to quit that lotion immediately I know that you it's expensive or you buy it with some money and you know you want to save some money but your skin is more important so if you're having stretch marks from a lotion if you're having rashes or your skin's itchy or it's burning on your skin stop that lotion with immediate effect and do the two weeks interval of you know replenishing your skin and rebuilding your skin let your skin breathe before you take on another lotion so that is the only exception for me so aside from that do not give up on your lotions give it some time to work and make sure you apply lotion twice a day that means you have to shower two times a day and don't forget to wear sunscreen all right thank you guys so much for being here see you in the next video on the geeks mantra